Welcome back everyone. Gas prices continue to rise as the state of Pennsylvania gets $4.86. New Jersey is $4.68. And for the first state of Delaware, it is $4.59. The national average of gas is $4.57. CBS3 was there at the Gulf gas station where the price of gas went up to $5.24. It's like highway robbery for those of you who know what I'm talking about. That's very painful to see things like this. And SUVs are the most popular things are on the road today. Let's go to Naomi Ruckham, my aunt, joining us live with that news story. Aunt Naomi, take it away. Looking to see how well they protect passengers in a side crash test. And this year's test was tougher. The IIHS introduced a larger barrier that travels faster to simulate the larger vehicles common on the road. The growth of SUVs and pickup trucks in the United States has resulted in heavier vehicles being involved in these kinds of collisions. IIHS President David Harkey says half the mid-size SUVs tested received a good rating. The rest came in at acceptable or marginal. The results are much better than recent testing on 20 different small SUVs. Only one received a good rating. Do you feel confident that car makers can and will make changes based on these results? We are confident in the auto industry and that they will respond to this new test. There's no doubt that they can do it. It's just a question of how long it takes them to employ some of the additional, perhaps structural measures, uh, restraint measures that will protect the occupants. The IIHS will soon perform side crash tests on other vehicles, including sedans, to see how they handle the impact. It's like I always say, watch your speed. Thank you, Aunt Naomi. If you're planning a family trip this summer, listen up. The experts at Philadelphia International Airport have tips to make your time in the airport a little bit easier. The weekend forecast looks like this, folks. 94 degrees on Saturday, May 21st, feeling like summer. And then the summer-like temperatures continue on Sunday, May 22nd, for when... It will be 91 degrees. So get those fans and air conditioners on, people. And don't sweat like a sweat box. We're coming right back, right after these messages. The seven-day forecast will be substituted by yours truly. It's going to happen. <laughs> 